the U.S. Justice Department is suing United Airlines. According to a document filed in Chicago Federal Court, United failed to give Lieutenant Colonel Daniel Fandre his fair benefits when he was called to active duty by the Air Force. Joining me now to talk about the details is CBS News Justice reporter Paula Reed. So, Paula, give us the background and the outlines of this case. The federal government alleges that the airline violated Fendray's employment rights when they failed to give him credit for sick leave that he accrued when he was on a military deployment. According to this lawsuit, in December 2012, when he was a pilot employed by the company now known as United after, after a merger, um, he went on a four-month deployment to Southeast Asia. But when he returned, they said that he couldn't get any of the sick leave that he would have accrued during that deployment with the Air Force Reserves. They said that according to their contract at the time, you could not accrue sick leave when you were on that kind of leave. Even if you were on vacation, however, you could accrue leave. So this lawsuit was filed on his behalf by the Department of Justice. And Paula, why is the Department of Justice getting involved? There are lots of special federal protections for members of the various armed services, specifically when it comes to student loans, car loans, mortgages, and also your civilian employment. The idea is that they don't want people who are serving their country to be at special risk of foreclosure, of repossession, or losing their jobs and their benefits. So the Department of Justice has a special unit that is going after employees or employers or companies who violate these special federal protections. And so, Paula, does United Airlines have a case here? United Airlines says that they are fully in compliant with federal law with all these protections. But also note, this lawsuit isn't about millions of dollars. It's about the equivalent of 10 hours of sick leave. The Department of Justice also wants the company to make sure it is in compliance with federal law. So it appears here, Elaine, the Department of Justice is trying to make an example out of United, is trying to make a point more so than getting tons of money out of the airline. All right, CBS News Justice reporter Paula Reed. Paula, thank you.